LaKendrick Shaw, owner of Metro Caps on Westside Avenue and founder of the new clothing store Glore at 646 Montgomery Street, spoke with Real Jersey City at the grand opening of his store, starting with his roots in business. So how I got my start was I worked, I, I, I studied business in college. I went to NJCU. I'm a Jersey City native, born and raised, and I always knew that I wanted to do business and I had a knack for business, so business was a natural fit to me. So when I arrived on campus, I wanted to study either finance or accountant, and I interned at an accounting firm my freshman year, and then from then on I always interned in the financial services sector, and then my junior year of college I decided that I wanted to try something entrepreneurial, and that's when I got my start on Westside Avenue selling hats, and then from there I'm here now at Montgomery Street selling clothes. I followed up by asking Shaw what the biggest barrier for entrepreneurs in Jersey City is. I feel like we're in a society now where you can be innovative and, you know, it's rewarding to be a innovative. You know, you got different outlets such as crowdfunding and you also, you know, you got venture capital funding. So it's various avenues of how you can get funding. So I think the, the, the biggest barrier to entry right now is being motivated and believing you could do it. So basically confidence. Finally, Shaw said that the best thing the city could do is advertise its services better to small businesses. The Jersey City Economic Development Corporation, when I, when I first got my start at Metro Caps, I went over there and they were helpful, but they made me do a, a ton of business plans and everything was very theoretical. So in the process of me getting started, they were not able to help me that much. But I know now things are very different, and if I approach them with our history and what we're doing, they would be more helpful. But I think what they could do to help other aspiring entrepreneurs or people who need help in local small businesses is make themselves more accessible and, 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 and advertise to business owners in the city and let them know that they're there and what they have to offer. So that's how I feel like they can help more. I'm Michael Sherman with Real Jersey City, the talk of the town.